Hello, this is the Beer Search Party. This is Sean Inman with you, and today I am reviewing the Anchor Brewing Merry Christmas and Happy New Year beer from 2013. Uh, it's also called Our Special Ale, and here are some of the bottles that I have gone through over the past few days. I've stored a few of these throughout the years, and I did a vertical tasting from 2008, which is the bottle there on your left, all the way through 2013, so you can see... We've got slightly different trees from ones with unpronounceable Latin names to ones that are much more uh, ghoulish sort of looking like the 2011. Then you got 2012 which is looking a little weird too. But then you get up to 2013 and you get that beautiful California white fur. So that is a beautiful looking uh, label, very classic. Uh, each year the font sort of changes, things move around, so you get this lovely uh, look into what uh, each year has to offer. And so we come to 2013, which I have put in the appropriate glassware, as you can see. We got a nice little Christmas type goblet for it. So let's get a taste of the 2013 Anchor Brewing Our Special Ale. Okay, so it's pretty, pretty light. You don't, uh, you get some little toast notes going. Um, a little bit of that spruce is far in the back. But it is a very light beer. Generally, these come in around 5.5%. I think, yeah, 5.5 this year. And they, they're generally almost anchor steamish, um, in my opinion. But they always have that little complex little notes off to the side. And this one has a little bit of toast, a little bit of spruce. Um, it's not, uh, it's pretty light, so it's got a bit of a, it's not fizzy or bubbly, but it does have a really nice sort of slightly warmish taste. I, I consider this one of the better California Christmas beers simply because it is so light. Uh, generally, California, obviously, this year being a little different, we generally don't get a lot of cold weather. You can usually see people in shorts and flip-flops all the way up till Christmas, uh, which is a disturbing sight. But uh, this sort of fits into that we're in a hot weather climb, we need something that's a little on the lighter side. You can't be drinking 12% big imperial stouts all the time, especially especially here. You just you need something a little lighter. And this beer simply proves that um, a nice simple beer with a little bit of spruce to it can give you some really nice, really nice notes. And uh, this year, uh, lighter on the spruce than past years, but still, a classic that um, I think people should try every year and jot down their notes. And this year I did a lot of uh, comparing what these beers tasted like in 2013 versus what they taste like in 2012. And hopefully I'll bring a store of those little notes so that you can see how these things age through the years. Um, it's a very interesting experiment, some that doesn't work all the time, but it's it's a fun thing to try, and it's a great Christmas tradition that I've just instituted over the last couple years. So there you go. It's the Anchor Christmas beer from 2013. It's a lovely brown color, and I suggest you pick up a six-pack, or you can buy one of those big, huge bottles if you're feeling uber generous and very Father Christmassy. So there you go. Cheers, and Merry Christmas to you.